make Marco's vengeance against Princess Catherine. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Uh, thank you everyone for liking and subscribing and welcome to my new subscribers. I hope you have uh, fun going through my readings and please don't hesitate to comment, ask questions. Uh, I love hearing from you all. Uh, our two little naughty elves here, Christmas elves, are our mascots for the uh, festive month. And we're definitely getting into the thick of things now. I'll just put these over here uh, so they can oversee, oversee the reading. I have the pulp tarot out today. So I'm sure you can guess who I'm going to be reading about. I'm on part four. Who would have thought? Part four of Megan's Mannerisms. Uh, this has come from the vengeance that, and, and pure venom that was released on the book last, last week against Catherine. And when you look into a person to find out or their mannerisms, you start noticing more and more. And I mean, you like, you know, in general, when someone is so nasty and vindictive, I actually saw a couple of photos and it didn't take me, didn't take me long to, to realize just how vindictive their followers are. Uh, on Twitter, they, I actually got attacked earlier this week by, I don't even know what I said, but it was pretty mild. I mean, you know, I like to be a little bit diplomatic. And they ended up following me on over, so definite trolls. They ended up following me over because one of them turned around, apart from abusing me and nasty, actually did hashtag on my Twitter account, Kate, Kate, Kate. And I thought, you disgusting piece of you know, S, H, I, T. And I was really, really, and of course I block. I don't put up with any of that nonsense, none at all. No nonsense whatsoever. And as soon as I saw them on the channel, blocked immediately. They did have a go at one of the su subscribers. I have upped, and YouTube has actually upped it, and I've agreed because of the venom that was being uh that they're trying to get out um so if anything or if any of my subscribers have come across these vile people please let me know please dm me in the descriptions you've got my email send me an email and let me know or in any of the comments uh, because I'm on high restriction now. Uh, that doesn't mean that your comments won't come through. But, uh, yeah, because of what happened, I mean, how dare they put that on my page? How dare they do that disgusting hashtag? <gasps> so that got me wondering why. What is the vengeance against Princess Catherine? Why? Why? What is her problem? I mean, sure, she hooked up with the spare. He was a spare, and yes, he's the regent, and he could also take over, you know, if something happened, which is really, really scary, and to be perfectly honest, more so now, um, he needs to be removed from the line of success and forget the titles because at the end of the day, it's irrelevant. Just be, just be removed because he's always going to be a prince anyway. So that's not, you know. It, if you remove the the dukedom, I think is is the correct terminology. Please let me know in the comments if I haven't said it correctly. If you remove that, he's still going to be prince, and that means that she will be prince. She will be prince, um, princess. Sorry, she will be princess Harold. She will be princess Harold, and he will still be technically regent if something happens. Something you know, until George is 18. And it's like, yeah, yeah, not good, not good. All right, so cards. Let's clear, clear these cards. <sighs> energies behind, energies, please, cards, energies. Megan Markle's energies behind her vengeance against Princess Catherine. 
why why is Megan so nasty and ven and vengeful when you have a look at the pictures it's been going on since day dot since the get go why what is Megan's problem with Catherine? Megan's problem with Catherine, please. Megan's problem with Princess Catherine. Oh, okay, let's play this one. Ha! Huh. Bingo. You know what? I'm not going to cut them. I'm not going to cut them. I'm being told not to cut them. That one popped out. It flew out. So let's just go. Mm-hmm. Two of Wands. High Priestess Reverse. Two of Cups. Four of Cups. Hmm. Very emotional. Very, very emotional indeed. And you've got a couple of twos here as well. This one's wife, which is, as we all know, strength. I think if you've been following me through, uh, strength is, is uh, Megan's major arcana card because she's a Leo, had the world in her hands with the two of wands and she had all the options. The, the world was basically her, her oyster, but the secrets are slowly coming out. The secrets are slowly coming out, which was to do with the partnership, and not looking, not looking, not looking at anything, not not wanting to, how can I say, not wanting to play nice, being stubborn, being stubborn like a, like a lion. But with the truth starting to, to drip away, there's no such thing as a partnership, none whatsoever. I don't know what she was thinking. Maybe she was thinking that, you know, Catherine was going to be her BFF. I, Knight of Cups in shining armor, coming to save the day. Knight of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Seven of Wands. Yes, she's very defensive. Megan is very, very defensive, despite how she sees herself she sees herself as an independent person she doesn't need a male around her which is ironic which is really really ironic this is a, a single person uh that has a lot of money uh a show person yeah definitely uh a lot of megan's readings uh, the nine of pentacles always comes up sometimes reverse sometimes upright but the fact that we've got it upright this time with the knight in shining armor i'm reading this as harry likes to see himself as the knight in shining armor doesn't he the knight in shining armor and the single lady hmm they didn't want to see anything they didn't want a partnership uh, with with you know william and catherine obviously and or this one was more than capable of doing it all by herself this is what a single woman is all about. Page of Wands, yes, nasty, 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 nasty. Four of Pentacles, dropping money. They sure are. Nasty messages and dropping money. So it's actually costing her to get all the vengeance against her. According to these cards, it's actually costing her not only to defend her actions, which did show in a reading last week, that she was defending what she said, what she, she, mm, deep breath, deep breath. <laughs> yeah, horrible energy, nasty energy, nasty energy around this person. Bad. All right, let's have a look what's in here. Yep, Ace of Swords. It's all BS absolutely bs and she's not going to finish the ace is um starting like another chapter so starting like a a new beginning so to speak so it's all bs uh, bs when when swords are reversed because it's all about the truth and justice is also 
very much uh, related with the swords and uh yeah when it's reverse of course it's it's not true king of cups reverse six of swords reverse page of swords <gasps> king of swords and to, oh good lord good lord lies upon lies upon lies upon lies oh wow 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 unbelievable unbelievable lies upon the king lies upon charles moving not moving like just just really really murky murky waters attack 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 especially on the internet with william this is william's card and ten of swords is ruined well <gasps> i guess i guess that's one good thing and just remembering what i just said lies it lies upon lies upon lies upon lies I remember her own sister, Megan's sister, actually saying that. I remember seeing that. Maybe that's where I got that from. I don't know. But at the end of the day, any tarot reader will actually definitely confirm this, will confirm this for sure. Swords reverse, as I said. A lies ruin, the ruin card, the emperor, the emperor reverse. Ace of Wands reverse, Nine of Wands reverse, Knight of Swords. <laughs> Guess what? More lies, more attacks, more vicious attacks this time. When the Knight comes in, he's there, there, there. It, it's going to get worse. It's going to get worse. There's no hope. It's indefensible what they're doing absolutely indefensible their action is so negative against charles it's so negative and this is because they're ruined they're absolutely ruined this this is energy of the current this reading is a current energy reading on what's happened against the vengeance sorry the vengeance against princess catherine I don't even see here where she thought it was a good idea to do this, apart from just being cocky, being cocky and thinking that she can run, she doesn't need a partnership and she can run. She can run it all on her own. She can do what she wants. She doesn't need anyone. Huh. Wow. Wow wow one more time ace of cups six of wands the full reverse justice reverse and the ten of pentacles yeah they 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 they're done they're literally done there is a full blown attack literally a full-blown attack they're trying to offer love because they want the victory but they are foolish and whatever they've done is technically illegal and there's no justice and it's unbalanced on the legacy on the legacy on the royal family the inheritance yep well that's a good sign I see that as a fantastic sign. There's no way, after the vicious attack, there's no way they're going to get what they want. They may see it as a victory and they're, and they're offering love. I don't see how they're offering love at all. They want a new beginning. And if they get the new beginning, they'll see it as a victory. But you know what? They're foolish and there's no justice. No justice for the legacy. Nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. And here he is here. William 
I have said this so many times, so, so many times. Harry hasn't even popped up in this reading because it is about the vengeance against William's wife. Catherine, as usual, is quiet here. There is no evidence here of Catherine. This is purely Megan against William. And he will, he will, he will definitely, he will stop it. He will stop it. It's, yeah, there's no hope. No hope. Good on you, William. Good on you. Awesome. Okay. I'm happy with that. Especially after the kind of things that were actually put on my Twitter page. It's just, where is it? Where is it? It's just, yeah, so much bad energy. S terrible, terrible things that they put. And to try and bring that hashtag, it's, wow. Hmm. All right, okay, sorry. A little bit emotional there, but, you know, when I see something so horrible, um, to think that, you know, these kind of people follow this person here, no, no. I don't accept that and neither should any of you please contact me i will do not and i will not hesitate to block someone I, that's how strongly i feel i'm sure you'll understand that i'm australian and we don't put up with any bs and it's like game on if you're going to start doing stuff like that we don't and don't answer them don't answer them just contact with me screenshot it email me okay i will not tolerate anything my my channel is all about readings and purely entertainment purposes only. And there's no need for anything like that. It's like, it's a tarot boot reading, people. Seriously, it's a tarot reading. You know, unbelievable. I'm sorry. I'm now going to go and smudge everything. And I hope you can follow me over for my next reading. And, uh, yeah, please like, subscribe. And I'll see you soon. Bye.